for you. I promise to stay true to you. I promise to grow old with you. I promise to take care of our future children. I promise to provide for you. I promise to accept you for who you are. I promise to love you forever, buddy. <laughs> I promise to love you in good times and in the bad times. <clears throat> Happy wedding day. This snuck up on us quickly, but I couldn't be happier. I truly do love you and always will. So thankful for meeting you and having God's plan come together for us. When times get rough, I just remember to look through these notes and remember my promises. You and I still both know I'm a man of my word. Even when times are good, I hope you look through this book. I just want to put a smile on your face. I love you. Happy seven year anniversary. P.S. I promise to help you with the animals, especially bubs. <laughs> Well, the day is finally here. I have known since I first met you that you were going to be my husband. A month before we met, but you know us new kid lingos. I first met you that you were going to be my husband. I love how you have supported me through everything. Here are my promises to you. I promise to always love you. Uh, to always be faithful to you. To never get mad when you get grease stains on the carpet. <laughs> Which is valid. I put some new light switches in and got a greasy shoe was upset. <laughs> to always tell you when I'm going to bring another animal home. <laughs> Alright, let's close this. <laughs> to be the best version of myself. To be the best mother to your children. To always be down for trying new things with you. To never stop washing your smelly socks. <laughs> That's a pretty they terrible smell. job. They're bad. They're awful. And lastly, I promise to always drive you totally insane. Here's to forever. I love you. Your future wife. That's nice. That's nice. Oh my god, the old classic notebook paper. <laughs> love to see tears. I already cried last night. I can't read this. It's like Santa. Do I need to read it out loud? Yep. Well, to my little buddy, well, today has arrived. Today you get to marry the love of your life and say, I do. I'll never forget the moment you were born. I held you in my arms and then kissed your tiny forehead. And here we are, 23 years later, and I will still kiss that forehead. I know from when you were growing up, we're going to be a smart young man. Gosh, it seems just like yesterday you were fixing computers, patching little odds and ends to, to get together for me. <laughs> Always. something to keep those little hands busy. Even though those little hands got you in trouble sometimes. <laughs> okay, maybe more than one. Uh, I knew that God had a plan in which those hands would come in very good use one day. That day has come, taking Aaron's hand in marriage. Oh, we have had some challenges along the way a little buddy but those challenges made us both stronger in our own ways. I believe God put Aaron in your life for a reason. To me she was your saving grace and I am truly honored to call her my daughter. You are marrying into a wonderful family who loves you dearly. Well I better go. Oh, all right. I'm pretty tired now, and we have a long day ahead of us, so I will dry, dry, dry. I'll dry my eyes, okay? Because you know I'm crying while writing this. Yeah, you can see the stains on the tears. Uh, uh -huh. I. I want to tell you how proud I am of you, and I wish you and Aaron all the best. But no matter what, you're always going to be my little buddy. You are loved beyond measure. Romans 8.38.